And then you might want to, after you've got it kind of surfaced, you might want to go over it one more time, just add a little bit more paint on there. Then after we do that, you're going to take your comb and you're going to drag the comb through the paint. What's really important to note when you're doing the combing technique is that you're going to want to do it immediately after you paint because if you don't do it immediately after you paint, you're just going to be peeling off some big chunks of paint, more like a, more like a paint scraper than a comb. So you don't want to get it while it's nice and wet, not when it's clumping together. So the second decorative painting technique we're going to talk about today is called bagging. And it's called bagging because the primary tool is a simple plastic bag that you get from your grocery store. Um, what you're going to do uh, for bagging is you're going to crumple the bag up into a little ball that fits inside your hand. And you're going to get this nice little texture on your bag. And you're just going to lightly dip it in your paint. Sometimes it helps to get a little bit of the paint off of the bag before you put it on the wall. And you're just going to dab it on the wall just really lightly. Kind of like you're uh, 